Good afternoon YouTube and welcome back to Gabe Tech Channel 305. It's been a while since I launched a video, but here we are. Today we're going to be talking about an exciting demo of Kaseya VSA. It is a uh, software tool that allows you to remote connect to different machines. And from what I've seen, it basically allows you to add users as well, give them access. And uh, yeah. For those of you that don't know, Kaseya is an MSP, uh, managed service provider. They provide services so that you can basically um, manage your IT company or manage your users in your company and give them access and connect to different computers. Uh, there's a lot of details I haven't explored, but let's take a look. Yeah, who's excited for Kaseya VSA? Yeah. So, yeah. You guys are great. Thank you. All right, let's get started. So here we have Kaseya VSA. I'm just going to give it a trial. These are some user preferences. I'm not going to worry about it so much. Look at the naming policy. So this looks like you can name certain machines, connection gateway. I've actually only used Kaseya in school. Oh, okay. This has me as a user. And let's see, let's create another user. Email. Yeah, this was similar to the one I did in school. Say John Jones 105 at Yahoo. Um, initial role. Yeah, let's say KB admin. Initial scope. Uh, let's make um, a uh, system. First name John Jones. <laughs> Username. I'm just going to say again John Jones. 105, a password. I'm gonna make a small password. And make them require change and next logon, save. Ah, okay. You can't make it the same as the username. So let's just say JJ. Uh, J Jones. One, two, five. Required as the username. Okay, so I have to make the username. Well, shouldn't have done cut. Always do copy. So copy, save, and there we go. I'll save it. So now, oh, look at that. Now I have a user, KB admin. You see, it's cool, cool stuff. This is just a demo, but really cool. Machine rolls, it's been a while. From my understanding, you copy the permissions based on certain machines. Uh, their version of machine is computer or, or anything used as a, yeah, anything used as a computer. It could be a desktop, a laptop. So roles, look over here. Here you just have roles. So I could change his assignment, which I'm not going to. And these are the scopes, which we saw before. Log on hours. This is fun. So I'm going to say, uh, I can click off. I'm going to say that he can't work Sundays and Saturdays. And he can pretty much work any hours in between. It's usually not common. Oh, what the heck, let me put them between 8 a.m. and, uh, oh, where is it? Okay, here it is, 5 p.m. I'm just gonna do the same throughout um, Monday through Friday. Same, eight, Five p.m. Again, eight a.m. to five p.m. Again, this last one. Okay, there we go. Sign that. Your history. That's pretty much the sum of everything. And probably when they logged on, so you see the times here. Manage. Uh, 
in groups. Yes, yeah, so this is very similar to the one in school. Oh, we get to get that, set up types. I'm not really sure what that does. Well, let's go to log on policy. All right, so I can change their password policies. Prior password every X amount of time, enforce password length. Let's say eight characters. And where's the save button? Update, oh, there we go. So I save that, eight characters. Color scheme, this is just, you know, just to change the color. I'll stick to the classic. Site customization. And then again, more uh, aesthetics. Let's see, VMS integration. This looks like something about a logo. Check the log. This has to deal with networking, transaction log. And uh, let's check out clients. I yeah, could register a client. That's neat. System log. And I'll pretty much conclude here.